I'm going to take my Pro Vocal Chain, which is worth almost a thousand dollars, and show you how I recreated it with entirely free plugins. Oh, and by the way, I found a free version of this bad boy too. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Fabio from Noise. Welcome to Boombox, the home of collaboration. If you follow Noise London on Instagram, you'll know that I recently put out a story asking for you to submit your tracks via Boombox for a free mix and master. Yep, this is something we're gonna be doing twice a month. So make sure you go and follow me. Link is in the description below and look out for that story or post with instructions on how you can submit your tracks. The one I decided to go with today is IDWPM, which stands for I Don't Want a Piece of Me by Rich Power, which sounds like this. I don't wanna lose my mind. Say your press it on twice. I've thought about this carefully Ignorance is hard to see The reason I decided to focus on vocals for this video is because the artist left specific time-stamped feedback on the vocals. Check it out. So if I click on this one here, it will take me to the first one. These are all in order. A lot of background, a lot of elements are buried in the mix. I agree, in the original, guitar and vocal are clashing. Main vocal is not consistent in terms of volume and presence. Vocals are too dark and muddy. So using the chain that I've created, we're gonna address all these issues that the artist has touched on. Let's take a listen to the vocal completely dry. Things are looking up, but we're still miles away. We'll never stop, we all just want to be enough. So I usually start with an SSL 4 KB. I like the compression on this, I like the EQ on this, and the high pass. The free alternative I found is called the Chan Nev. This is by Analog Obsession. Yes, it's a Neve channel, not an SSL channel, but I wanted something with a mic pre that I could drive for saturation, that could give me an EQ section, and a compressor all in one to emulate the channel strip. So I'm driving that mic pre for saturation. I'm doing a low cut up to the same point as I was on the SSL, that's 136 hertz. I'm doing a little bell dip at 330, and then I'm doing a shelf boost at 3,300 hertz. I'm also using the compressor with a really fast release and a sort of medium ratio, and a little bit of the tape drive on the output. So looking up, but we're still miles away. We'll never stop, we all just want to be enough and fall in love someday. You'll be like a drug, make an addict out of me. I'll be like a sponge, I soak it all up, yeah, too much. It's what you'll never hear from me, yeah. So I'm taking out a bit of low end, adding some air, and pushing and sculpting the signal closer to where I want to be. These are broad strokes, which create a great starting point. Now next, I use the Smooth Operator, which is a paid plugin. It's a great dynamic EQ, similar to Soothe, that does a good job of compressing certain frequency areas. Now the free version I'm using is the TDR Nova, and I'm specifically using this to compress some of the lower frequencies around the 200 range. So let me show you how I'm doing that. I'm gonna turn this band on. You can see there's a slight dip of 0.7 dB. It's set at 246 hertz a ratio of 2.1 to 1. Now, if you turn this threshold button on and off, it becomes a compressor at this frequency EQ point. Let's have a listen to it. Things are looking up, but we're still miles away. We'll never stop, we all just want to be enough. I know it's making it a little bit thin, so what I did was I added another band on top with a static EQ. So this isn't doing any compression or expanding. This is just a normal bell EQ boosting that area. The intention here is to control the change in volume of those low frequencies, but then bring the whole thing up together. Things are looking up, but we're still miles away. We'll never stop, we all just want to be enough and fall in love someday. You'll be like a drug, make an addict out of me. I'll be like a sponge, I soak it all up, yeah, too much. It's what you'll never hear from me, yeah. 
I like those low frequencies because they give that proximity effect which makes the singer feel like they're close to the mic or closer to the audience, makes it more intimate. If you take up too many of those nice, low, warm frequencies, things get a bit thin and start to sound unnatural. Now next, I'm using the 1176 Rev A. Yes, this is the UAD paid version, but don't worry, click on the link above to go to one of my other videos on Boombox with some of my favorite free plugins, including a free version of this one right here. Now what I really love the 1176 for is it's fast, aggressive compression. So it clamps down on the transients, controlling the volume. Things are looking up, but we're still miles away. We'll never stop, we all just want to be enough and fall in love someday. You'll be like a drug, make an addict out of me. I'll be like a sponge, I soak it all up. Yeah, too much is what you'll never hear from me. Yeah. So I've got a fast attack, really fast release. I'm compressing about 5 dB, and you can hear that there's a slight tonal change when I turn that on and off. Now next, I used the Neve 1073 preamp by UAD. The free version of this is the Brit Channel by Analog Obsession. I'm doing a boost, and this is at about 10, 12K. This is a shelf boost. I'm doing another boost at 360 hertz, bringing back some of that body, some of that warmth. And then I'm taking out with a shelf 110, so just reducing the amount of low frequencies in that area, the low, low frequencies, which didn't sound quite right, especially in context, which we'll hear later on. Things are looking up. But we're still miles away We'll never stop, we all just want to be enough And fall in love someday You'll be like a drug, make an addict out of me I'll be like a sponge, I soak it all up Yeah, too much is what you'll never hear from me yeah. So it's subtle, but it does add that nice sheen to the vocal. The moment you've all been waiting for, Soothe 2, which I love using for dealing with high, harsh frequencies and also de-essing. Now the free version we're gonna be using is the Wave Grove by Vastals. The main two dials that you need to take note of here are the wet and the tame. Let's start with the wet. I'm gonna increase this and notice how it starts to tame those high frequencies. I'm also gonna turn the delta on and off so we can hear exactly which frequencies it's taking out. Things are looking up, but we're still miles away. We'll never stop, we all just want to be enough and fall in love someday. You'll be like a drug, make an addict out of me. I'll be like a sponge, I soak it all up. Yeah, too much is what you'll never hear from me. Yeah. Notice how it does a great job of preserving the volume as you take out those high frequencies. The more we take out, the more dull it becomes. We don't want it to be too dull, but we do want to control some of that harshness. Let's turn that delta button on and off so we can understand exactly what this plugin is pulling out. Things are looking up. But we're still miles away We'll never stop, we all just want to be enough And fall in love someday I'm gonna keep this here for now and we're gonna adjust the tame. Now the tame deals more with the transits. The more we increase the tame, the more we actually add that compression. You'll notice that the more tame we add, the flatter the sound and the more unnatural it becomes. Things are looking up but we're still miles away We'll never stop, we all just want to be enough And fall in love someday You'll be like a drug, make an addict out of me I'll be like a sponge, I soak it all up Yeah, too much is what you'll never hear from me yeah. What I love about this plugin is that it works just like Soothe in the way that we can use it as a de and a de-harsher for those high frequencies. Last but not least, I added OTT. I have the vocal where I want it. I want to give it a little bit of a lift with this upwards and downwards compression. So it increases the parts of the frequency that are low in volume and then brings the parts that are loud down in the high, middle, and low frequencies. So it's a multi-band upward and downward compressor. I'm gonna increase this to show you exactly what it's doing, but I only use a tiny, tiny, tiny bit. Things are looking up. But we're still miles away We'll never stop, we all just want to be enough And fall in love someday Let's take a listen to a before and after I don't wanna lose my mind Say your prayers, say them twice I don't fall asleep I've thought about 
this carefully Ignorance is hard to see If you want your trap mixed and mastered for free by me, read the link in the description below and get your files uploaded to Boombox. All the instructions are down there. I can't wait to listen to your music. There are gonna be loads of contests like this. So free mix and masters, feedbacks, and so much more. And welcome to the home of collaboration. It's been a pleasure as always, and I'll see you very soon. Peace.